YouTube. Today we're going to talk about Michael Jackson. Y'all know Michael Jackson is not dead. For the simple reason, um, y'all remember when uh, at the front funeral, uh, Paris, they tried to make her get up there and say some shit. When she already knew her daddy was at home somewhere. He's not dead. And then when the coroner picked him up. And put him in the ambulance. Well, they were acting like they put him in the ambulance. Because uh, whoever was, they were covered up. And... Uh, the coroner took him to the uh, the funeral home or wherever they take their uh, to, to examine the body. And Michael Jackson, he instead of them bringing the bed out, he jumped out of the damn uh, coroner van. Y'all know Michael Jackson. All this money he got, he can set up some shit like that. And what Oprah did, she killed him all over again. Even though he's not dead. She killed his heart. He see everything that bitch doing. And he know that's, that's not a friend of his. Even though he let that bitch in his house. I think she was uh, jealous because he uh, got more attention than, than her. She felt like he was above her. You know how black people, when one person gets something, they get jealous. And they got to do something to degrade you. And that's all it was. Just like Gail and uh, Oprah trying to down our black people. When them bitches know they go together.
she's got to keep on uh, doing what she's supposed to do. And that's uh, try to be Janet Jackson. Yes. Your man said in an interview that he wished that he'd been the one to die and not Michael. As a father, how do you react to that? Well, I can't. That's your main talking, you know. And that's yeah, but how do you feel when you hear it? Well, that's what, that's what Jermaine thought, and maybe that's what uh, his reaction was. But he's living, and Michael is dead, and so, and so um, that's the way it is. It's not him. Isn't it hard? Isn't it hard to accept? Accept what, Larry? That your son is gone. Of course, it's very hard. It's not just me. It's so hard for the whole family and the world. Because Michael did so much for the for the whole world, and uh, which uh, he never was, uh, or never was. Um, well, he never. The people never give him his just due for the things that, that the, all the things that he has done. Huh. Oh, we get to some of that. that when little Paris uh, spoke at the end, everyone, of course, was immensely touched and impressed. A lot of people uh, were especially moved. What do you, why, how do you think she was able to do that, get up and talk in front of that crowd? Well, uh, she's a Jackson, you know, and that's all I can say about that at the moment. But, but uh, she's got a lot of nerve, yes. Are you saying it's in the genes? <laughs> yeah, of course it's in the genes. Where else could it be? Do you think these children might go into show business? I can't get into that uh, right now, Larry, because of, I just can't. Uh, but uh, they like to watch movies and things, and that's sure. They watch pitch shows on TV and stuff, you know. What can I say? I mean, down the, ro down the road, if they expressed an interest, I mean, you raised the family, they all got into show business. If the grandchildren wanted to, would you encourage Larry, them? Larry, I know where you're trying to go with that. And I don't I'm not trying to go anywhere. I'm asking you, would you encourage them? No, I'm not, I'm, not, I'm not encouraging them to do nothing. Not, not, not the sort. They have to be what they are, kids at the moment, yes, and be raised properly. So those rumors that you wanted to tour the Jackson Three. Not true. Not... That that's a bunch of jive. That's a bunch. I wish I could say what I should say. But that's a bunch of bull. <laughs> yes, a bunch of bull. Do you spend a lot of time with the grandkids? Uh, I don't spend. Uh, I'm, I live in Las Vegas, and they live in L.A., and I go back and forward sometimes. Yes. Where is where is Michael's body? I don't know. I get, you have to ask somebody that knows. I don't know. All I know is I, I was at the memorial, and uh, where they took it from there, uh, I have to find out. I'll let you know later, Larry. Okay, but as the father, one would think you would have the most imminent right to know. I do have that right, but uh, I'm not talking about that right now. Okay, Jermaine talked to me about seeing Michael's body and saying goodbye. Did you get a chance to say goodbye? Yes, I said goodbye to him when he was up, well, when he was up there in front of us, you know. And I say, I'm saying goodbye to him now. Uh, but uh, what the others say, that's what they say. But what I'm saying is, I do feel the loss my son, Michael Jackson, who was an international star all over the world. But you, you didn't get to see the body or say anything? No, I did not. To the remains? 